Betelgeuse, the star found in the Orion constellation, has always stood out in the night sky. It's not just big, it's one of the largest stars visible to the naked eye. What's made it more fascinating in recent years is its strange and changing behavior. For centuries, this star has been a familiar sight for skywatchers. But lately, scientists have noticed sudden changes in its brightness. These unusual shifts could be a sign that Betelgeuse is getting ready for a supernova, a giant explosion that happens at the end of a star's life. If this happens, it could become brighter than the full moon, possibly even visible during the day. In late 2019 and early 2020, people around the world noticed what became known as the Great Dimming. Betelgeuse became noticeably fainter, causing excitement and worry among astronomers. Many wondered if the star was about to explode. Then, just as suddenly, the star grew bright again, leaving experts puzzled. In 2023, the star's brightness increased by 142%, according to Betelgeuse bot on Twitter. This spike was confirmed by the American Association of Variable Star Observers. Thanks to this, Betelgeuse moved up from the 10th to the 7th brightest star in the sky. This shift amazed both scientists and amateur astronomers. If you're in the Southern Hemisphere, you can see Betelgeuse easily in the evening sky. In the Northern Hemisphere, it's becoming clearer, especially as nights get longer. This makes it a perfect time for people everywhere to watch the sky and maybe witness a rare cosmic event. Betelgeuse is about 650 light years away from Earth. That might sound far, but in space terms, it's pretty close. If it goes supernova, we'll have a front row seat to one of the most amazing light shows the universe can offer. It won't hurt Earth, but the light would be spectacular. Ancient people, like the Greeks and Aboriginal Australians, noticed Betelgeuse and kept records of how it's bright. Scientists know its usual cycle lasts about 400 days, but now it's changing every 130 days or less. This is a big clue that something different is happening. Dr. Andrea Dupree, a well-known astrophysicist at the Harvard Smithsonian Center, said that in 2019, Betelgeuse ejected a large cloud of gas from its surface. That gas likely caused the dimming. She believes this is part of the star's slow journey toward its end. Even though Betelgeuse is acting strange, scientists think it still has time. A study from Harvard and the University of California, Berkeley says it might take 5 to 10 more years for the star to return to normal. But it could also surprise us. Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, which means it has a very hot core where atoms are constantly being smashed together. First, it fuses helium into carbon, then heavier elements like oxygen, silicon, and iron. Once the iron builds up, the star can't hold up its own weight, and that's when it collapses and explodes. If Betelgeuse's core is heavy enough, it might turn into a neutron star or even a black hole. That would be the final step in its life, but its explosion fields that could form new stars and planets someday. The energy from a supernova is enormous. It can outshine entire galaxies for a short time. Scientists all over the world are using telescopes and satellites to watch Betelgeuse closely, hoping to learn more about what happens when a star dies. Professor Peter Grove, from the University of Portsmouth, said predicting the exact moment of a star's death is still impossible. We can see the signs, but we don't know when the final moment will come, he explained. It's like waiting for a volcano to erupt. Despite all our technology, humans have only seen a few supernovae with our own eyes. If Betelgeuse goes supernova, it would be the first one visible like this in modern history. It would be a once-in-a-lifetime event. This isn't just important for astronomers. It matters to everyone who's ever looked up at the stars and wondered what's out there. The sky would look different for weeks or even months. Some scientists think it could be bright enough to cast shadows at night. 
The study of stars like Betelgeuse helps us understand more about the life cycle of stars. We can learn what makes them live, change, and die. We also learn how elements like carbon and oxygen, the same ones in our bodies, are made in stars. This is why astronomers, both amateur and professional, are so excited. Betelgeuse gives us a chance to study a dying star up close, something that's extremely rare. Every new observation teaches us more about the universe and our place in it. More interesting facts keep emerging. Scientists have used data from NASA's Hubble Space Telescope and other tools to create models showing how Betelgeuse's outer layers move. These models show huge waves and gas bubbles traveling across its surface. Some even compare Betelgeuse's behavior to a giant boiling pot, with massive gas pockets rising and falling. These movements affect how the light reaches Earth and may be part of the reason the star dims and brightens in unexpected ways. There's even more to explore. Researchers studying the star's emissions in infrared and radio wavelengths have found surprising patterns that don't match what they see in other red supergiants. These findings could change what we know about how big stars live and die. In addition to light, Betelgeuse also gives off gravitational waves and neutrinos, invisible particles that pass through almost everything. If the star does explode, scientists expect to detect a burst of these particles. It would be the first time we watch a supernova this way. Dr. Jessica Liu, an astrophysicist at UC Berkeley, says, we are entering an era where we can watch stars live and die in real time. Betelgeuse is like a giant cosmic lab right above our heads. Some scientists are even using machine learning to study the data from Betelgeuse. Computers can scan thousands of measurements quickly and look for signs humans might miss. This could help predict future changes more accurately. Even if Betelgeuse doesn't explode soon, it's still giving us new information. Every new study, every change in brightness, adds to our knowledge. It's teaching us about the forces that shape the cosmos. For now, Betelgeuse remains a mystery. It keeps shining, keeping scientists on their toes. We may not know when the end will come, but we'll be watching and learning until it does. So, if you enjoy exploring space and discovering the secrets of the stars, keep your eyes on Betelgeuse. It might just surprise us all. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.